May, we've got job interviews in Slovenia. Morning, we are in Ljubljana, well I think that's how you say it, Slovenia. First impressions, beautiful place, quiet and really cold, literally. I got off at the airport and there's snow everywhere, but luckily there's no snow in the city centre. Nevertheless, it is freezing. So today is day one of the challenge, but there is a slight twist with this challenge. Those of you who've been here since I hit 100k, I put a 100k special video out. And in that video, I was basically giving one of you a chance to come on a challenge with me. That chance has now come on this challenge. Firstly, thank you to everybody who emailed me their videos on that video, messaged me on Instagram, emails, Twitter, you name it, thank you. So, this was the winning video. Hi Simon, my name is Richard, I'm 33 from Watford. Firstly, congratulations on your 100k subs. I'd love to win this competition because I think you're a massive inspiration to a lot of people, the way that you get around with no money in your pocket and the things that you do. I'd love to travel really anywhere because to explore something different and new somewhere out of my comfort zone would be great. So hopefully I can win this and we can do it. So that's Richard, he's 33 from Watford. So I normally fly out of Manchester for these challenges, but I ended up going down to Luton Airport. I met Richard there and then yeah we've come to Slovenia. Do you want to introduce yourself mate? Hi guys, how you doing? My name's Richard, I'm 33 from Watford. I'm married. I've You're got married? Married mate. Mate, is she gonna be with us going on Tinder? I could, <laughs> I, I could be divorced, but it could be fun. Yeah, I have a 12 year old daughter as well. I work in Tesco for 16 years as a butcher and a fishmonger. For me, this is out of my comfort zone. This is gonna be great. I hope so mate, it's <laughs> raining, it's freezing. It is freezing cold. <laughs> like, the rain is non-stop. It is cold as anything. Do you think you'd be in Slovenia this week? No. Like, literally <laughs> as well we only organized this literally three days before we came yeah. no not even that no. two days before we came <laughs> yeah. literally last minute yeah not even a clue what was happening where we were going every credit though for like stepping out your comfort zone and just coming to Slovenia mate. mate this is out of my comfort zone like this is something that I have to say thank you so much for this is oh, such mate, a great don't be thing daft. we're in this together mate. mate we're gonna have a good one right mate challenge begins here mate, before it. we start I just want to say a massive thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video and also for supporting me. I'll tell you a bit more about them at the end of the video. So I'm thinking how we're gonna start this day off, right? It's freezing. There's no way that we can sleep outside in this. I don't even think we'd last, right? <laughs> we won't last. We need to earn money to try and book us into a hotel or a hostel tonight. But I don't know what the like the wages are like around here. It might be like two euros an hour for all I know. So we are literally in the center of Ljubljana now. This is like a famous thing. Three bridges, there's like one there, one here and one there. On top of that, there's like a castle right at the top up there. I think we're gonna have to do that. We've got to do it. That's like, I think that's like a to-do thing, isn't yeah. it, over here? So this is where I'm at and this is what I'm thinking, right? So we either, one, go to the castle now and check it out yeah. and see what's up there, or two, we just get to work, try and make some money doing something, whether it's get a job or try and make it, and then obviously try and get some money for tonight. It's up to you. Let's get some money. Sweet, let's go and get some let's money. Go. Firstly, we've just spotted this market. As you can see, because it's raining, it's dead. Dead. There is more market over here though, so we're just gonna head there. I don't know what, ask them can we like Sounds. help them lift stuff or sell stuff or? It's, I don't know. Uh, give it a go, we've got to try something. Right, so we're in the middle of the market now and again, it's just dead. There's even like empty stalls over there. That's how dead it is. I can't see us getting anything here, can you? No. At the same time as I don't think we're gonna get any offer. We may as well try while we're here. We've got to try. Excuse me mate, do you speak English? A little. A little. Do you have any jobs? Do you know what jobs means? All right, let me get Google Translate. One second. Dello. 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 Yeah, <laughs> Do you know, know what Dello is? Job. Dello is work. Work. Yeah, yeah, work. work. Do you have work? Do yeah. you have any work? Do, would anyone round here have work? I think no. You think no? No problem. Thank you very much for your help. Thanks. Well, that went down like a sack of potatoes. Right, there's like clothing ones over here. It's your turn now. My turn. Hey, do you speak English? Yes. Um, do you have any work? going at what? Dello, work. You need job. Yeah. Yeah, we're looking just to earn some money. Like to help you. I Pro don't need help. 
<laughs> Got to try. In the corner. Ah, okay, yeah. There is information for for okay. for job for something like that. Great, thank you. thank you. Have a lovely day. Fair dues to that lady. You're not a bad effort, that mate. Yeah, she was sound. She said something about a corner information job. So we're just trying to find where she was talking about, and we're going to see there. Off we go. Tourist information. Let's give this a go. I wonder if you could help me. Where can you find work in Ljubljana as an English speaker? Usually you need some contracts or something like that to work because they're ah, quite strict. Okay. I think it's the best if you go to Adeco. It's over here and they could maybe possibly help you. Cheers. Thank you. Thanks very much, man. Thank you. What a cool guy. Everybody's so helpful around here, but to be honest, I don't think it's the news we wanted, is it? Definitely I think not. you've got to get like a permit or something to work here. Ideally, I just want somebody to say, oh yeah, here's 10 euros for moving some furniture or I don't know. Worst case, mate, if I can find someone to play guitar, I'll go on the tambourine, mate, and you can Tam sing. Can you actually sing? Can you I sing? I can't sing. Mate, I'll give it a go. Would you? Yeah. Oh, mate, every mate, we're doing it. So we've just got back to the three bridges. I've had a few messages from some subscribers in Slovenia. Can you believe? I've got subscribers in Slovenia, it's crazy. Mate, it's mad Slovenia. <laughs> so one guy, Nikolaj, I put, hey Nikolaj, how's it going? Do you know anyone who can play guitar? He put, I'm good, thanks. Yes, I know, I put, that's awesome. We're trying to make some money in the center. It's proving hard. Just wondering if we can get someone who plays guitar so we can sing on the road. He's put, hmm, interesting idea. I will ask everyone that I know and hope that they will be able to do it. The thing is now though, we can't obviously just wait on Nikolaj. We've only tried the market, haven't yeah. we? We haven't like really gone hard and gone in restaurants, but then is that a way waste the time because they said about the permit. permit. Let's yeah. just ask, just let's go around go. restaurants and just ask. We're just gonna go in, see if we can like hand out leaflets, try and get people in. I don't know, let's see how we go. The first restaurant is coming up on the right. Shall I go first? Mate, go for it. Do you have any work here at all? Holy cow, can you just give me a second? Yeah, no worries yeah. at all, sorry man. Yeah. Yeah. Simon, nice to meet you. Richard. Jan, could you just leave me a contact? Yeah, no problem at all. So, cool. what's your so name? You said si Simon, yeah? Simon Wilson. Perfect, see thank you, you very much. You call you back. Yeah, cool. Thank That's you. great, thank you. That could have gone worse, to be fair. Mate, that was let's, let's hope he rings back. back later. Right, mate, you'll go. Is there any chance that we can have a bit of work? We have actually job interviews today at 3 o'clock. Students are coming. So yeah. you might come at 3 o'clock. So I don't know about the schedule, you might have to wait yeah. a bit. But no, that's fine. I will introduce you to my CEO. Okay. Ah, cool. Yeah. So if we come back at 3, you're doing job interviews? Yeah. Oh, okay, awesome. Cool. We'll come Thank back at 3. Thanks very much for your help. Thank you. May, we've got job interviews in Slovenia. I'm leaving work. I'm moving in. <laughs> <laughs> so I've just realized three o'clock is in like what 20 20 minutes 20 minutes So we're just gonna hang about and we're gonna go straight to that job interview. How many people do you reckon in total? Easy ten people here. There is literally loads of people one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and eleven twelve Not including <laughs> anyone else inside <laughs> <laughs> Loads of people. Mate, I think this is like a group interview. He's gonna start speaking <laughs> Slovenian <laughs> When they finish, I tell him. Yeah, 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 that's fine. No problem at all. Should Cheers, mate. Down? Yeah, sure. We'll okay. just take a seat. Cheers. Thanks very much, mate. It would take us like at least two weeks to get you ready. Everybody's gonna set up these tents yeah. and stuff. Ah, uh, okay. So that's why I was thinking. Ah, uh, I'm with you. But there's no way I'm gonna talk him into a few days because. Yeah, no, that's it. I just thought like maybe deliver some leaflets or something like that. Do you get me? You should check some hostels. They are usually up for this, and I know a restaurant that would be up for this. Restaurant Sokol. These are two hostels. Hostels very near. Yeah. There's a map. And check other hostels too. Thank you. Appreciate, you it. appreciate it. Yeah. Thank you very much. Have a good day. No luck with the jobs. We've both tried a few places now. The only thing that we've got like sort of pending is the fact that that one place took my number. So fingers crossed that they ring me back with a job. Obviously, we've got the few places that that guy gave us on the paper, which we'll probably check out now. Yeah. Yeah. The other thing, you know, we were mentioning the guitar. We've got someone on a piano over there. Do you reckon you could sing to that? It's not even a piano. He's got like little sticks. Excuse me. You want a singer? Like you play and he sing. Yes. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. What can you play? Mate, do you reckon you can sing to that? Do you play any Drake or <laughs> do you play any like chart music? Okay. No, no problem at all. Thank you. It's lovely to meet you. All the best. Thank you. What a guy, but he just didn't play anything we knew, so we couldn't really do anything, to be honest. Right, we are now going to the restaurant. Is this it here? This is it here, mate. That the guy from the interview place give us, and he said they do stuff like that here, so... 
I'm um, just wondering if you've got like any work, like delivering leaflets or trying to get tourists in or anything like that at all. Yeah, just a moment. Uh, I took uh, for a manager, you know. Ah, okay, that's great. Thank you very much. Just wondering if you've got any work at all. Only make a deal if you are willing to work the whole December. The whole of December. Yeah, no, this just not for a like, few days. This is just not. Right. No problem. Thanks very much for your help. Yeah, anyway, welcome. thank you. And we've hustled all day. Obviously, everything hasn't made the video, but we've hustled all day and we've had no success. Zero. How does it make you feel not having any money for food, obviously nowhere to sleep tonight, and it's getting dark now? It doesn't make me feel like 100% great. Are you glad you've come along? Yeah, 100%. <laughs> there's no way like I would not have come to this. Like I could never give it up. We're going to make this work. We always make it work. That's how it goes. So the plan now, as I mentioned earlier, I've been speaking to a couple of subscribers from Slovenia. One of them being Nikolaj, who was trying to find the person to play the guitar. He's actually messaged and says he finishes work in like 15 minutes. So we're just on our way to meet him now. Nikolaj? Yeah, yeah. Nikolai. Uh, Nikolai. Uh, Nikolai, yeah, sorry. How are you? Nice to meet you, mate. So let me introduce you to Nikolai. Sorry, mate. I've been calling you Nikolaj. Yeah, yeah I'm Nikolai. <laughs> it's quite a hard name for foreigners to say, but it has Greek origin, but people think that it's from Russia. So firstly, apparently there's a book fair over yeah, here. It might be free coffee. Yeah, you said. It might, might be and some snacks. Oh, some mate, snacks I hope so. But I don't Are care. you hungry? <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. We're starving. On top of that, there's a casino that put out free food at 8 p.m. Yeah, so are we going to go to the casino after here? Then? Yes. Mate, yes. get mate, us some food. food. So is this the entrance for the book fair? Yes. Right, let's go and have a look at this. Book fair was a success. We got some water and some chocolates. How were the chocolates, Rich? Mate, I love the chocolates. What I love them too. Slovenian chocolate isn't really my thing, but I'm grateful for some food. We're on our way to the casino. How far is the casino from here? <coughs> Two minutes by foot. And what are the chances of food here, mate? Nine out of ten, I'll say. Nine out of yeah. ten. Coffee, oh. ten out of ten. Oh, so oh. coffee's guaranteed. Oh. Fingers crossed we can get some food. This is the casino coming up now. Looks pretty big, this. Is yeah, it big? It's, or? it's quite big, yeah. Please let it have free food. And you cannot take photos inside. No, I'm not going to take just, photos. Just yeah. you know. Right, so I didn't want to film in the casino because the big Slovenian employee said so. And with it being a casino, I thought I'd best not find out what would happen if I did. So, long story short, we had loads of hot chocolates. Then we had loads of Cokes. Then we had pasta. Then we had some more pasta. And then the Slovenian sausage came out. And the best thing was, we didn't spend a penny. It was all free. How's the food, mate? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five meals. Load up on the bananas, mate. Mate, that was sick. How many bananas did you get? That's when. <laughs> thank and you so much. Free coffee to go. And my hot chocolate. <laughs> yeah. Cheers. Oh. Mate, thank you so much for that casino. No problem. We mate. got fed well. Are you full now, Richard? Mate, I am full. <laughs> That's the thing with a casino though, like it's little things like that I wouldn't know about. So if I hadn't met you today, we wouldn't have known about that casino. True that, yeah. And we'd have probably been still starving. So Nikolai has got a sick day planned for us tomorrow. Unfortunately, his friends actually come good with the guitar. What time are we meeting them? At 10 a.m. I don't fancy singing in public <laughs> in Slovenia. I, but we're gonna do it. On top of that, there's two massive like local rivals, is that what yeah, you Yeah, basically Olympia Ljubljana and Enka Mura. So those two teams are playing tomorrow tomorrow night in the stadium. Nikolai actually works in that stadium, so we don't have to sneak in. Yes. You're just gonna let us in. Yes. So we've got a right day planned tomorrow. Yeah. Pleasure, thank you so much for thank everything. Thank you very much. Nikolai, uh, thank tomorrow you. Tomorrow 10 a.m., right? Tomorrow 10 a.m. Take it easy. Safe yeah, journey home, mate, I'll see you at 10. What a guy, mate. He has sorted us right out today. Yeah. And not only that, what a day he's got planned tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm well out for that, I'm so excited. I, right, now, mate, it's for the hard bit. It's even raining on the lens. The time now is, three minutes past midnight and we ain't got a clue where we're sleeping and it's obviously starting to rain. <laughs> I think the best bet, if we walk by the river, there's like hotels and stuff down there. Yeah, we'll so go. we'll go down there and just try our luck. <laughs> yeah. So we're now back by the three bridges that's literally just behind me in the square. Before we find somewhere to sleep, I just want to thank Squarespace again. If you don't know anything about Squarespace, Squarespace is a great all-in-one platform where you can use its award-winning design template to create your own 
website, blog, or even an online store. If you're looking to start a side business, it's a great way to start and it's really easy to use. It also offers domains if you haven't got one, like I've got skinstuff.com for my online store. Go and check out squarespace.com slash Simon Wilson. It should be on the screen. Also, the link's in description. You get a free trial and 10% off your first purchase. Bargain? Bargain. Bargain. So, where are we sleeping? Mate, there's literally no hotels anywhere. Everywhere's closed. So, we've just been walking down a bit further and we've spotted all these Christmas huts. One, two, three. They literally keep going. There's obviously a Christmas market going to be all down here. But that guy said the 1st of December, first didn't December, he? Yeah. So, basically, the Christmas market hasn't started yet, so they're all empty. I am not even going to try and recreate the scene of us trying the doors <laughs> on these Christmas markets because every door for about how many do you think there is rich up and about down here 30, about 30 Christmas market huts they're all open they ain't even locked so tonight we are gonna stay in <laughs> Slovenia's Christmas market Merry Christmas <laughs> Merry Christmas <laughs> mate you just need to pick one now which one should we stay in this one looks good to me so tonight we are staying in Zisha's tea house let me just find the light one minute. Oh my god, mate. Look at the state of the place. There's the window to sell Zisha's tea through. And you've got shelves up there. Mate, this is absolutely filthy, this. Mate, we're gonna have to be really quiet in here. If someone walks past, we're screwed. Right, we're gonna end the vlog there. Thanks very much for all the support. If you've not subscribed, make sure you do. Richard, have you got any last words? Night, guys. I'll see you in the morning.